<laughs> oh, greetings, all. I thought I gave you the afternoon off. You did, and it was a kind and thoughtful gesture, and much appreciated. But my gorgeous date insisted on coming back here, right, Lulu? I said, you may not go out on a date with him. I forbid it. Well, that seems a bit harsh. Not that you get to choose who I go out with, but this isn't a date. But then what is it? See, Lulu got caught in a lie, I'm afraid, and the only way out was to make it come true. Okay, what he's trying to say is I used him to get back at Maxi, and then he messed it up, so I'm stuck with him just for the afternoon. I did not mess it up, and you'll be crazy about me by dark. That will never happen. has not been inventoried in days. Go take care of it. You came in the afternoon. Huh? I changed my mind. You're the bartender. Go do your job. This is all get you out of our diet, love. This isn't a date. It better not be. What is your problem? I thought you liked Ethan. I did. He has certain attractive qualities. He's a bad boy with sticky fingers who's good for business, and he's definitely not boring. OK, so why do you hate him all of a sudden? I'm beginning to think I should have listened to you in the first place. I think Ethan has an agenda. He's way too friendly, and he's staying way too long. Why, well, I agree. He's a liar and a thief, but I don't think he's dangerous. I don't trust him, and it goes beyond money. I think what he is after could be disastrous, especially for you and your father. Well, hello, you two. Did you miss me? Not for a second. Uh, you will. It's only a matter of time. I think you're exaggerating. It's not like he's a serial killer. I can't believe you want to go to a casino on such a nice day. Monica told me to do something I really enjoy. I love blackjack. He used to hit oh, yeah? the casinos all the time when I was in college. Will you do me a favor and open up a bottle of champagne and deal some blackjack over there? I'd be delighted. Would you be a little less obvious? <laughs> You care to join us, Your Highness? No, thank you. I'm fine over here. All right, Lulu? Not a chance. All right. Well, then, I guess it's just the prince and his fair maiden. <laughs> Welcome to the haunted star. My treat? No argument, please? Hey, thanks. Nicholas, I think this is a bad idea. What, gambling? No, you being anywhere near Emily's lookalike. Your father was completely obsessed with our mother. Your uncle Stefan was. I mean, it's a Cassidine thing. You're falling right into it. It needs to stop. So what do you say we play a few hands for no money while we wait? No, yeah, only play for money. Oh, a woman after my own heart. Stop flirting. Deal. It's the Modi. It's Tracy Quartermain. I want you to crank up that laptop and find out anything you can on Ethan. Love it. L-O-V-E-T-T, -T, the bartender from the Haunted Star. Find out all family connections, especially who his parents are.